My total weight for everything that I bought plus the packaging is around 35 kilos. We have to be smart and strategic because we only have our money. Do you want Hello, Camp Fam! We are not in Manila. We are in Vietnam. We have a ride over here, about to head to the hotel, no the sizzle. Can't get to shop today. This is our room. The lady at the reception said that we got upgraded to one that has a balcony. Ta da! We have a balcony over here. And, guys, the shower is also outside. I mean, that's your vibe, why not? It's either that or here. In this bathtub, which is open for all to see. My sister has seen me naked anyways, a million times. So, I don't really mind. Whichever way we go. But we're just waiting for our luggage. And then we're gonna head out to eat, to have bone dinner. Bone marrow pho. Bone marrow pho. So why did you book this, sis? Because it's bone marrow pho with pho ground. And you're saying this is a Michelin star? One star, I One Michelin. Michelin star. So the restaurant's name is Anan Saigon and it's very very close by. It's four minutes by walk only and I am starving. It's only 6 p.m. But I am so ready to eat because I really really want to sleep early so that tomorrow we will wake up refreshed and energized to shop to our heart's content because that is the goal for this trip to eat and to shop. Good morning, Cam Fam. So last night was a good meal. It's very much satisfied. Today, where are we going, Sisms? Plates. We're gonna go buy plates. We took in packay naman when coming here to Vietnam. I told my sister. She said because she wanted to go to Bangkok, so that's where we're headed next. But right now we're in Vietnam first because I told her I wanna go to Vietnam first because I wanna buy plates and Chanel. So as a homemaker and as a fashion girly, so there's this brand here in Vietnam called Amai, and they make really beautiful ceramic plates. And I am just so determined to buy like sets of plates for Kokor House. I will bring you guys with me, and you'll understand why I'm determined. And good. News is they're on sale. They're on sale. I'm gonna buy the whole store. This is my final haul. They're so pretty. And now the shopping continues. <laughs> We're currently at Takashimaya now. I told you guys, the point of this trip was really shopping and eating. But I'm really so happy that we went to Amai. Yun talaga yung kakay ko here in Vietnam. They're so known for their dinnerware. And it's great because even though they don't look like it, they look so delicate, they're actually dishwashing and microwave safe. So I got a bunch because I really planned to do an overhaul of our dinnerware at Kohor House. And I wanted to be able to mix and match the different ones. So I got a bunch in a dozen. And then I got a bunch also for like half a dozen. How many kilos? My total weight for everything that I bought plus the packaging because they have to pack that by it's around 35 kilos so I'm gonna try to bring it home originally I was thinking that Papa balik by unbox ko na lang but parang we think we can do it right so we're gonna do it and then now we're gonna eat first to recharge because plate shopping is hard tofu skin my thing so bad for you but so good as well eating and now we're headed to do some more shopping we're gonna go check out Chanel here because I saw on TikTok and this was verified to me by my friend who just came here the Chanel apparently is super duper competitively priced here in Vietnam like it's actually very competitive to European prices free tax free so like out of all the Asian countries this is the best place where you can get like really good prices for Chanel so I'm not really looking for a bag because we're going to Europe anyways but I want to buy some shoes so that's where we're headed A million shoes after we have our winners. He said I was coming only for one shoe. It wasn't even this. I wanted the normal ballet flats. Pero galing ni kuya magbenta, guys. Kaya nabudol tuloy tayo. After this, uwi na us. No, no, no. My sister says she wants to stop by other stores first. So we'll do that. But I will just close my eyes. So, 
it's a brand new day and we are starting our day here this market it's a tandin market we're waiting for our tour to start we're doing a not a tour but a cooking class and the class starts here at tandin market we're supposed to meet up with the chef here and we're gonna buy some goods first before we go and cook i hope we're at the right gate though i'll let you guys know if we're still waiting here and there's no chef in sight we found our chef we're at the right place my sister was even doubting me but of course i'm perfect no. So we're currently at the Tandin market already and our chef was telling us that this was built during the French colonial period. It's already more than a hundred years old. And we're now off to buy some vegetables for our cooking class. So we're at the restaurant now and we're about to cook. And this is what we're cooking! So this is for Morning Glory salad. We're gonna go cook our beef over there. And this is the final product, Morning Glory salad. There we go, our lotus fried rice. We're now off to the airport after our morning class. So that was a fun half day spent. We started at around 8 a.m. 7.50 was the meeting time. And then it lasted until 11.30 a.m. And so we had a few hours to kill at the hotel just waiting for our airport transfer, which I also booked through Kluk. So everything actually was booked through Kluk. Even our cooking class was also booked through Kluk. It's just so convenient. And so I don't have to worry, especially now that we're traveling just two girls. When I'm with Yoni, I also don't have to worry because Yoni has to think of all these things. But we're more adventurous. But now that we're just girls, I'd rather just have all these booked so that you know I just feel safer and also everything's just more convenient. We don't have to think about these things. So if you guys want to check out Kluk, like for hotels, for activities, for airport transfers, make sure to check out the links below. I have the links to the stuff that we booked, but you can also click that link to look for other stuff that you want, even for other countries. And also make sure to use my 5% discount code, which is it's Camille Call, ITS Camille Call. And all our bags are here already safely. My plates are here. <laughs> I'm stressing how we're gonna be carrying this to the airport and getting this from the conveyor belt. I am a dragon after all and dragons are usually lucky so let's hope that my luck will still power through this entire time. So we're now off to the airport and we're gonna fly to Bangkok. Just waiting for our car to arrive from the airport transfer that I booked on Cloak. And then we're so ready to rest. My monthly visitor also just came, so my back is really killing me. And my sister and I have agreed that we will just do room service tonight. Finally in our hotel here in Bangkok. It's such a huge hotel. The lobby looks fancy. I know the location was also pretty good. That's why I chose this hotel on Cloak. Again, I chose on Cloak. I said the deals are just so good, so anyway. I know this is like right beside a SkyTrain station, so we'll find out more tomorrow. It's currently already almost 9 p.m., so I am already it's very sleepy. It's 10 p.m. in the Philippines. It's 10 p.m. in the Philippines, yes, so it is past our bedtime, correct? Correct. Brain is no okay. longer functioning. Here we are. Home sweet home. You're in Bangkok. Let's check out the bathroom. We approve of the bathroom. We were planning to get room service, but the kitchen is already closed, so we got grab food instead. I left it to my sister to order. And she ordered the entire menu. <laughs> <laughs> ordered dessert now. <laughs> okay. Good morning, Cam Fat. Well, actually, it's no longer morning. It is currently 12 noon already. And as I've said, we are starting the day late. As I've told my sister, since it's my first day, I wanted a slow morning and she agreed she has obliged. So what did I do just now? <laughs> I just wanted to show you our view. Look, it's so nice. My sister and I aren't sure if that's the famous temple here in Bangkok. It looks like it though. If it is, we're so lucky that's our view. It's so pretty. But anyway, now we're gonna head out to lunch and then we're gonna go shop. As if my luggage space back. We'll figure it out. But anyway, we shall go look for a restaurant. But before that, let me show you my fit. This is today's fit as a cool mom. And then my bag is this one. 
Right? And then my sister as a Fresh. as a working girl, like a colegiala look, Gen Z colegiala. While waiting for our grabs, I want to show you our lobby. The hotel is so big. I didn't appreciate this last night when we arrived because it was already nighttime. But it's huge. Look at this area, it's so nice too. The location is also really, really nice. I'm just so happy with our choice. The booking I did on Coop, it already has a free breakfast, so we don't have to worry about that. And their breakfast is really good. Lots of selections, and I'm sure that Yoni will love it as well. Because usually Yoni loves it if there's like lots of breads and like cheese and ham. And they had a lot of those so they had like a lot of Asian and also Western options so he'll really really love it So we're currently at the Commons. This is something that was recommended to me by Lorene. It's at the Thong Lore area. And I was just reading their info there that they also have a new branch that opened somewhere else. And it's my first time here at the Thong Lore area. And I was just looking at it on the way here while we were in the car. And then the whole area, like they had so many nice boutiques, stores, cafes. And I feel like it's their new hip area. And maybe next time I come here, I'm gonna be staying at Thong Lore instead. But yeah, super cool. And lots of design stores as well. Like you know that the area is nice and hip if there's a lot of nice design stores. Hey guys, it's time for Kagulo. We're now at the Platinum Mall. I'm sure I've been here before to shop cheap clothes. It's been a while since I've been to a super crowded mall. <laughs> okay, so I remember correctly na, na all the stores here in Platinum are cash basis only. Because I remember before when we went here, last time I was here with Yoni, I was not prepared at all. We didn't have any cash. So he had to withdraw because I also did not bring any debit card with me. So yeah, if you guys want to come here, make sure that you have cash. And then if you usually buy like two, they already count that as wholesale price. Hindi naman malaki yung discount nila for the wholesale also. Like 100 baht off lang. Like that. A discount is a discount. But a discount is a discount. That is indeed true. That is what our mother has taught us. We have to be smart and strategic because it's only a little money. First purchase for me is this, and it's so cheap. Also comes in this cream color and that black color. It's one two ninety, and it's one two if you buy it in wholesale. Also got these tube tops that comes with these wires already. They're on sale. Yay! Found some nice sets here, and they're pretty cheap. Like these knits. Told my sister to get this one because it's really cute. They're all like below six hundred baht. Found these really nice vests as well for together they're 1100 baht very nice expensive though 1250 for one that's already wholesale price but it's beautiful kulang yung money mo kulang found these as well 600 baht looks so chic i found these silk skirts that are so cute Okay, so we're now back in the hotel room. Let me show you my haul. You're not gonna try it on because I'm lazy and I'm tired and, and it's this. <laughs> and it's the second day of my period. I would just also like to say, I'm kira po magtrabaho with my sister here because every time and then I have to repeat things because she would suddenly cough or she would like, it's funny. Do something. She's currently having an asthma attack. Kasi. So, yeah, I'm going to plastic. Okay, so this is the skirt that I bought. I love it so much because I've been looking for a long black silk skirt. And this just looks super chic. It looks expensive. And I also got it in white. And it's really what I've been wanting for the longest time. It's not white. It's kind of like ivory. Look at it flow. And then from one silk number to another, I got this boyfriend blazer in silk. I mean, it's just all wrinkled now, but it's really so beautiful. It's in this peach color. I know that quiet luxury is such a huge thing now. I just want to say that if you guys want to look expensive, it's not about the brands. It's really about ironing your clothes. Beautifully ironed clothes will already make you look 10 times more expensive. And then, I also got this really chic set. It's the first one that I bought. Ta-da! Super nice. It's like a box silhouette. Lang. It's a straight silhouette. The blush color. I really am so tired. I'm sure that you guys will appreciate this more if I wear them, but just imagine. 
So this mini skirt with this matching vest. And then I got this set as well. It's like a loose sweater vest. Knit top. And then it's got a matching skirt. Perfect for lazy days. Also got these oversized denim vests. Love, love, love. And then this is my sister's favorite out of all the stuff that I purchased. So it's a knit strapless top. It's got something stiff here. Like I don't know how to describe it. But I don't my wire shot underneath. So I got it in two colors. Got it also in orange. And then this one is my sister's pick for me. She saw this first. I really loved it. I ended up getting this one instead of the white one. So I feel like this one's more eye-catching. It also looks classier, I feel. We have here another maxi skirt in green that I got on sale. Super sule. And then I got this for events. Super nice. It's see-through. I think it's also the most expensive out of all of my purchases. Also got this bright colored one. And that is it for my Platinum Mall haul. Now we will rest and then we will go to Paste Restaurant. Time to eat because we exhausted so much energy in this shopping adventure. It's our last full day here in Bangkok. This is me with my pimple patches, my micro needle pimple patches that I'm also trying out. I am brave to go out with them because no one knows me anyways. Or if they do, then don't judge me, tao lang. Anyway, we're now gonna go where? Icon Siam. Icon Siam, the newest mall here in Bangkok. This was recommended to my sister by her friend, and my sister wanted to try out this like floating restaurant that they have there. So if you guys wanna do floating restaurant, but you don't want the heat, then you do it inside that mall. Let's go. There's also souvenirs here, aside from food. The place is huge. It's 11 floors, but we're only on the first floor pala. But now I figured out like why the entrance is here. Because it's like, if you want to experience the night market or the market here in Bangkok, the floating market experience. Of course, it's not as legit as the real thing. But you don't want to sweat, which is valid because I also don't like sweating. You know, sometimes you just don't have the patience for it. So this is where you go. I imagine though that it's probably more expensive than if you would eat at a night market. Obviously, prices are probably higher but it's also a much more convenient experience everything's just easier but if you're like me and my sister medyo na win lang kami with all the choices so we're gonna go to this restaurant that my sister's friend recommended instead which is also in this mall and it's not a market experience anymore kasi nga na win lang kami dun sa market so we'll go there instead we're currently on the second floor and they have Takashimaya here so this is their Japanese floor according to my sister who's researched the place so this is really a mall but it's got different themes I'm guessing but yeah a mono mall it's Smells like yummy food all over. They also have a kitty play area here. This mall is huge. Oh my gosh. So we've settled for this restaurant. It's called Look Kai Tong. It was recommended by my sister's local Thai friend. But the menu was this thing. So windong pa rin ako because naming options. But at least there were photos, so it was easier for us to choose. You know, this has been our first trip, just the two of us, since I got married. Yeah. But then again, there was a pandemic also. So she actually used to be my OG travel buddy for most of my travels, like for work and for play. I have like things go wrong and I don't have a travel buddy. My sister is usually a travel buddy. But that is why now when my sister came calling, I was like, my turn. <laughs> she has a bit of free time because she just switched companies. And so before she moves on to another company, she wanted to do like a quick trip somewhere. And Bangkok was her request, Vietnam was mine. Well, actually, her first request was Borobudur. But then the flight schedules were kind of challenging. So Bangkok it is. I feel like we need to do a financial advice vlog again, part two. Actually, remember she kept talking about insurance on that vlog. She's actually now a licensed insurance agent. So my sister now wants me to buy from her first though before she allows to guess on another financial yeah. advice vlog. But is there anything that you think you weren't able to share in that vlog? Na feeling more important to share. I think it's more of like annual review of where you are. Okay, so that is her additional bonus advice. Make an annual review of where you are. How do you review? Like an Excel file? Oh, naman siguro if like when you're receiving this, 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 you have to check lang for it's still, still a life. Maybe you're saving for like a single life. But a married. Ka na. Or like, Ah. And then like, you start your family. 
family and stuff like that or like baby pa lang and then biglang mag start na mag school which is pretty aligned ka and stuff so parang annually you need to do like a self evaluation self evaluation if your financial goals still align with your current yeah. life situation yes. kasi parang pwede like you're an employee and then biglang mag business ka totoo totoo so then it wouldn't be the same goals yeah. so there you go I send my fee <laughs> Financial advice while we wait for our food. I'm so hungry na. Because she didn't wake up early. She said she'll take advantage of this trip because there's no Sienna bug to wake her up. Mommies can relate. Already done with shopping, mostly my sister's shopping. I really had some restraint and only bought a hat. But my sister thinks that I only was able to do well because we only had an hour to shop. But no, I think it's because I have newly installed restraint software. But anyway, we're now off to get a beautiful spa massage. Actually, before coming here, I was already asking my sister, like, maybe we can book a like a luxury spa experience because I would like to feel like a madame after all the walking and shopping and everything. But everything that her friend recommended to us they were all fully booked na but we were able to get this mid-range Chulux spa booking it's called let's relax also available on cook and since i'm on my period we can't really do all the like mud soaks and like scrubs and all that so we're doing the i don't know there's a package where you're doing the back and shoulders massage plus foot reflexology i'm so excited i mean thailand is the land of great massages so it would be a pity to leave without a full-on spa experience So the package that we got was like almost three hours and it's just so good. Next time I come here, I'm gonna be coming here again next month. I will book that premium spot that I originally wanted to book. Because if this was already so good, what more by on? Just I'm excited. But anyway, I'm gonna change and then we're off to dinner. See you then as a refreshed woman. The hotel hacking has started. My sister's bag is about to explode. Mine is still chilling. But anyway, that is it for our Thailand vlog. I am so excited to see Sienna Bug tomorrow. I promise to put her to sleep before I fly out again the next day for work. See you guys in the next vlog. Bye!